In this tutorial, I will show you how to use Paperbell and give you an honest review of the platform. So Paperbell is a tool built for coaches that offers features such as collecting payments, hosting your coaching program, and quite a few more things such as scheduling, client management contracts, a client portal, group coaching, but I'll just show you how you can use it. So to get started, you can just go to paperbell.com and click get your free account. Now what I really like about their pricing is it's completely free until you have your first client, no credit card required. But basically that means that you won't lose any money. So from here to sign up just enter your email and password. Then enter your first name, last name, time zone, your currency and go to read the privacy policy in terms and conditions. And if you agree then just tick the box right there. And then click complete account creation. Now from here, I'll just click on take me to my account. So now you can actually get started using Paperbell. Now they have this simple onboarding process that contains four steps. I recommend following this. So first you're going to create a package so that you have something to sell. So you can first choose if it's a one-time payment or a payment plan or if it's a subscription. So a payment plan is basically that they, for example, can pay it upfront but in four monthly installments, but it's still a one-time payment and they don't pay for their usage and the subscription is just a monthly subscription. Now, for example, I'll go with a one-time or payment plan. And then for the name, this is the name that you want to give to your package. And then here for the appointment details, you can either enable or disable this. And this is the number and duration of one-on-one -on -one appointments included in this package. So the number of appointments, let's say that I want to do five, and then it says 50 minutes. Now you can always change this if you want. For example, I'll make it one hour. Now you can also add appointments with different durations if you want. Now you can set up your checkout flow and you can really see how easy Paperbell is to use. They have pre-made everything specifically for coaches and courses. So the checkout flow can be book appointment and then purchase or purchase and then book appointment. But you can see the appointment will not be confirmed until checkout is complete. And on the other hand, here your client will only see the option to schedule after they have completed their purchase. I'll go with the first one. And now you can also enable a thank you page. Then for the status, you can make it active, invite only or past. You can also set a purchase limit, for example, a maximum amount of 20 and you can set an expiry date. Then click on save and now you can set the price. Now here you can choose again if it's a one-time payment or a payment plan. Now if you want to use the payment plan, you need to connect to Stripe. But this is again, for example, if it's $1,000, then you can choose the number of payments and the frequency so that they can pay in multiple installments. Now I'm just going to set it to a one-time payment of, for example, $250. And then click on save. Now here you can then set up your package description. So first you can add a cover image, then a teaser overview, so a short summary of the package, then here a full description, and then what the package includes. So automatically it has the appointments, but you could for example also add in a course or whatever you want to include in your package. And then once you click save, you then have created your package and that is step number one of four. Now from there you want to add the availability so that people can actually book in. So click add availability right here. Then just set when you are available and again make sure your time zone is correct. Now I'm going to set it to repeat and I'll do 9 to 5 from Monday to Friday. So then you have set up your availability. Next, just going to click connect your calendar so you will never be double booked. So you can use Google Calendar, Microsoft or Apple. Now I use Google Calendar, so I'll just connect to my Google Calendar. So then click save right there. And now you have connected your calendar. Now the only step you need to take is to connect Stripe or PayPal or both. So payment partner integration. So use Stripe or PayPal. And I think Stripe is best because they have lower fees and more payment options. So I'll click connect right there. Now if you don't have an account yet, then you can just go and create yours. But I'll just sign in with my account. So I've now connected Stripe to Paperbell and you can now see payments updated, then just click save. 
and now I can actually start taking payments. So now I have done the entire onboarding process. Now you can actually start using Paperbell to sell your coaching. So right here you will have a share button. If you click on that, you can copy this link. Now I'll just open it in an incognito tab to show you what it looks like. So from here they can see the course with the image you uploaded. They can click on learn more. And if you have multiple packages, they can see all of them here. And if you also added a short description, they will also be able to see that, but I didn't. And then once they click learn more, they can then see what is included. They can then see the full description here, but again, I didn't add that and the price. And then if you set it so that they could click on book now first and then pay, or if you have set it to pay first and then book, it depends on what the button says. I think the book now button is better because then they already kind of see how it works. So they can then book in, for example, 12 right here since I set my availability at that time then you already collect their email and then their first last name and optionally phone number and then after doing that they will then be taken to the Stripe checkout now here it kind of depends on which one the you see so if you connect with PayPal it won't look like this but personally I do think that Stripe is better but they can then just enter their details and pay and then they will have bought your coaching package so now when I refresh my paper bell and go into my clients right here, you can see the person shows up here and I haven't paid yet, but if I click on them, you can see they haven't made a purchase and no appointments. But if they have made a purchase, then it will be five appointments remaining. And you can just see that right there. And you can also click gift package. You can send them an email through here. You can send them a contract. You can set up a survey. You can even create private content for this person. You can also add any notes, which will only be visible for you. And that is how it looks when you do get a client. Now in the sales section right here, you can see all of your sales. So you can see all the purchases. You can always change your availability right here. And if you go to your appointments, you can see your appointments right here and also join them. Now they should also show up in the calendar which you connected. So for me in my Google Calendar. Now if I click on my profile picture in the top right and then go to settings right here, you will also be able to integrate with pretty much anything with the API key. You can also change the plan. And again, it is free until you have your first client. Then you can choose the notifications that you want. You can again set your availability settings right here. And here you can also change your shop URL. You can go and upload your logo. You can choose which button colors you want and background color. You can add a heading and even your terms and conditions can be entered right here. So now you know how to use Paperbell. Now, if you are an online coach or maybe you sell a course, then I do really recommend Paperbell. And I think it is a great platform. So that concludes this Paperbell tutorial and review. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.